Hi, this is Freya answering another one of your questions. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Well, today's question sounds funny, and I'm not going to name anyone who actually asked the question, but there is some truth in it, I guess, or there's some legitimate cause behind that. So someone asked the question, how do I not sound like a dying animal? It may sound funny, but I know exactly what you're talking about. Probably you're talking about not having very clear and clean tones, not having very good pitch control. It's just not clean. So whenever your singing is clean and all over the place, it may sound like a dying animal, like I am singing now. I'm just kind of exaggerating, trying to imitate like what, I, what I'm talking about. You mean kind of like that? That has to do with a lot of things. It has to do, first of all, with the fact that you're, have, you're not singing in defined registers. So you're not in head voice or chest voice. So the voice breaks and looks, it looks for its own way and it just takes the direction it wants to go. It's like, I'm not. See how my voice wants to break and wiggle and just be all over the place. So first of all, I want to establish some technical things. It's like good breath, take a deep breath, take your time, focus, have good posture. And then when you sing out, don't start singing something that is high and low and all over. Start trying to be clean singing in a very small area like I am singing now and really think very simplistic. Don't try to do all kinds of stuff. It's like when you start learning the piano, like my little daughter, sometimes she goes like all over the piano, but it sounds like garble, right? It's cacophony because she doesn't really know how to play with all her fingers yet. She kind of does melodies. She doesn't know how to do it yet. So you wouldn't start playing the piano in your first lesson. You wouldn't start going like, okay, playing all those harmonies all over the keyboard. No, you would start probably with one note, one finger, trying to find the right position, the right fingering, and try to train those fingers independently to where it works. And from there, you slowly work yourself up. Now in singing, a lot of people always think, okay, I'm just gonna sing this song. So how does it, why does it sound so terrible? It's because you haven't gotten the basics down. Now, of course, to some people it comes naturally, but if it doesn't, don't worry. It doesn't mean that you're never gonna be able to sing, but start with a really small, very simple stuff and then work your way up from there. Another thing is keeping a straight tone. So if you, sing one note and you can't even keep it very consistent and it moves like yeah work on that have even breath flow and then try to stay in a defined register if you don't know what the registers are watch my videos or somebody else's videos about the registers chest voice head voice those are the main important things that you need to know and try to sing a straight note yeah, if you can sing one note for a prolonged period of time and it's very straight and defined and clean and clear, then you can start moving on, okay? I don't want you to sound like a dying animal because that is not good. <laughs> and I want you to feel like a dying animal. It's a funny question, but I know exactly what you're talking about. Thank you so much for all of your questions. Keep on asking questions and I will try to answer them best as possible um, without seeing you and actually hearing you. Thanks guys. Don't forget my Facebook group, Master Your Voice. If you're not in the Facebook group yet, I would love to see you there. There's about 700 people in there right now and we have great conversations going on. No matter what level you're at, <laughs> whether you're at the beginning stages or if you're a seasoned pro touring all over the world looking for people to support you or you know some technical things that you want to work on great conversations going on there and especially motivation happening thanks guys see you next time until then don't forget always keep a song in your heart and always keep on singing bye now Stop.